Hi, this is Jeremy Kushner, CEO of BACS Consulting Group. As we come to the end of 2022 and look back, we see that this has been a year which has been a bumper crop of cyber activity across the board. Today, we're going to give you 10 essential security rules to help keep your environment in check and minimize the risk of a cybersecurity breach. If you'd like to learn more, please stick around. As we come to the end of 2022, we see that cyber crime continues to be on the rise and we see no signs of it abating. Today, we'd like to give you 10 cybersecurity rules to help minimize the risk of experiencing a breach. First and foremost, always beware of fake websites. There are websites which are designed to look like legitimate websites, sites that you visit frequently, such as your bank or shopping sites, but they're slightly modified and they contain phishing information in order to grab your credentials. Once they have these credentials, they can be used to leverage and get into exact real world websites. Tip number two is always to use secure online shopping sites. There's ways to make sure that the site is secure. So one thing that you will see is a lock in the URL bar, or you might see an S before the HTTP or after the HTTP. If you're not sure that the site is secure, stay away from it or consult with someone else that can help you identify whether you might be risk at risk or not. Tip number three is to always guard against phishing emails. These come in all the time in all shapes and sizes. No one is immune. Ways to minimize these are to have anti-spam filters, but more importantly, also make sure that you and your team are trained up and know how to recognize phishing scams. These are so prevalent that it's very important that you stay ahead of this. Tip number four is always to avoid pop-ups and ads. Some of the pop-ups are legitimate, but some of the pop-ups are scams which try to get you to go to, in, to illegitimate sites. Pop-up blockers are very helpful. If you don't have one, that's something that your IT, can help, IT team can help you put into place. Tip number five is regarding purchasing. Always use credit cards over debit cards. Why? because it's a lot easier to dispute a charge via a credit card than it is with a debit card. With a debit card, your money is gone instantly, and then you've got to go back to the bank and have them work on a claim, which can take days or weeks if they're ever able to get the money back. Tip number six, which is so important, is to always use secure and different passwords across the realm of websites that you visit. Do not recycle the same password over and over because if that password gets compromised, then every site you log into will also be compromised. Use a password manager and in many cases, take advantage of their password generation. This will generate passwords for you, which even you will not know, but it will be stored in the password manager. This ensures that each site has a unique secure password. Tip number seven is to always use secure wireless networks. If you join a wireless network and it does not ask you for a password, it is not secure. So at your home and your place of business, make sure it's secure. And then when you're out and about, whether you're traveling or you're just around town and you connect to a wireless network, if it's not secure, don't use it. And especially don't do any sort of transactions over an insecure network that data can be intercepted and used by criminals. Tip number eight is to make sure that your cybersecurity software is always up to date and set to update automatically. Make sure you're using a paid subscription service. The free cybersecurity software out there is not good because it does not update on a regular basis and in many cases does not have the cutting edge technology. Tip number nine is to make sure to always monitor your bank accounts for any sort of suspicious activity. If you see charges which you don't recognize or other transactions, you're going to want to re reach out to your bank immediately. Finally, the last tip, which is probably the most crucial, is to avoid social media scams. Really, the biggest weak link in cybersecurity is the human element. 
people sometimes make decisions without thinking things through. So if you're involved in social media and you see something suspicious, someone asking for money or someone appealing to the human element of something that doesn't seem right, avoid it. These are our 10 cybersecurity rules for 2022 and the holiday season. If you like what you heard, please subscribe to our channel. And if you'd like to learn more about how we can help you better secure your environment, please reach out to BACS. Our contact information is below.